Hello and welcome to my video on smooth muscle contraction and relaxation from a human physiology series. So something that separates smooth muscle from skeletal muscle is that smooth muscle starts off with calcium entering the cell from the extracellular fluid. In skeletal muscle, it comes from the sarcoplasmic reticulum releasing the calcium. But as the smooth muscle releases this calcium into the cell, the, that signals the sarcoplasmic reticulum to also release calcium. In smooth muscle, this intracellular calcium then goes on to bind to a protein called calmodulin. This calcium and calmodulin complex then go on to activate myosin light chain kinase. That's the MLCK you see in the picture. This myosin light chain kinase then goes on to phosphorylate the light chain of the myosin heads. You see there's the inactive myosin and then ATP is used in the phosphorylation of this myosin to make it active. The myosin that's been activated, it then goes on to bind to actin and there it slides along the actin increasing the muscle tension. Now once the muscle is done contracting, the cell is signaled to then start releasing calcium and this release will start the process of relaxation. The calmodulin then releases from the calcium. When the activated myosin is ready to be inactivated, another protein called myosin phosphatase comes in and it removes a phosphate from the myosin light chain. It's not the active myosin light chain kinase that does this, but the myosin phosphatase. It takes off the phosphate and ADP then becomes ATP and the myosin heads are inactivated. The myosin heads then unbind from the actin and this allows the muscle to relax. So decreased muscle tension occurs. That's been my video on smooth muscle contraction and relaxation. Thanks for watching.